a day of bombs and bloodshed. This is the aftermath of an explosion in the southern city of Basra. The wrecked cars and food stalls are evidence of the carnage that was caused. It's understood the device was detonated close to a car repair workshop, but many people were in the area when it went off. It's a terrorist attack by a car bomb that has killed people and wounded many more. The attack also set on fire four cars and damaged a number of shops because this industrial area was crowded with people. The explosion in Basra was just one of a series to strike Iraq on Sunday. This was the scene in the holy city of Kerbala after another car bomb. Again, an industrial area was targeted at a busy time in the morning. And again, people were killed. The explosion happened near the Abu Ashwak restaurant in the industrial neighborhood. And this was the scene in the Iraqi capital, where an explosive device was detonated as the deputy head of Baghdad's provincial council was driving past in convoy. It's understood that Riyad al Adad survived the blast, but two nearby civilians were not so fortunate. The explosion happened at the crossroads. It hit a lot of cars and caused a lot of other damage. While no group has claimed it carried out these explosions, they form part of a wave of violence across Iraq that has already killed more than 500 people this month alone. Dominic Kane, Al Jazeera.